Progressives Congress, APC, Ogun State Youth Council, has advocated for the re-election of the incumbent governor, Dapuabi Odun. According to the Special Assistant on Youth and Sport to the state governor, Olamide Lawal, during the annual Freedom Walk, tagged Ogun Youth Walk Continuity, he maintained that the governor's achievement over the years amounts for his endorsement by the youth. The chief of staff to the state governor, Dapuabi Odun, expressed his satisfaction as the youth decide their candidate comes 2023. So this year, we have tagged as continuity work because we feel that this governor, despite what he experienced during the electionary process, he was never vindictive. He has accommodated everybody and there is a high political tolerance and innovation. And you know when there is peace, there will definitely be development. For this reason, Ogo State used today, they decided that we must commemorate that attitude by showing solidarity, having continuity. Are you now calling for the governor to consider, you know, the second term in office? Yes, because we are very, very satisfied with what he's doing, particularly the inclusion of youth in his administration. In the, in, in the last decade, that has never happened in Ogo State, whereby you have a high number of youth in governance. But today, we, we have a governor that reckon with the youth, and for what we have experienced, is a governor that has taught every sector, is a governor that has done projects in every local government, is a governor that is not my ass, is a governor that, has, that is showing us a model of ambitions, which we are learning from. So for that reason, we want you to continue to 2027. First and foremost, I am impressed but not surprised. I am impressed by, because the people of the youth of Ogun State they have demonstrated once again that they are responsible youth who are very much involved actively in the political process in Ogun State. You will recollect that during the answers, the youth of Ogun State they demonstrated that they were angry, but they were not destructive. And that's why Ogun State was relatively peaceful, even during the exercise process. So today, they have come out to demonstrate their love and support for Prince Akbar Abiyadu administration. However, youth are advised to emulate the homoluabi traits from the governor in order to shy away from all social vices. And this is a proof that His Excellency Prince Dr. Dr. Abiyadu is somebody that is passionate about the youth, that somebody that knows that the youth is the leaders of tomorrow. We are so passionate, we are giving them the place where they belong to in this administration. We give the youth the place and we know very sure that they have the strength, they have the power, they have the agility and they can let the whole world know that this administration is doing well. When you see young people begin to advocate for a cause, I can assure you that that cause means that it has done well. Because the greatest people will feel the impact the most if it's not working well are the young people. And if they're the ones who will benefit, if ultimately it works well. So what you have seen today is an attestation to the fact that, you know, the young people in Ogun State have seen the good work of the governor and all they can do is to say, I mean, he has to just continue doing the good work that he has started. All right.